Okay, if you're on this YouTube, you're looking for information about how to fertilize your Pelia peperomioid. Um, if you have any questions about how to water it, or the best soil to use, or um, the best pot to grow it in, I have a playlist on my channel, um, Let's Talk About Plants, where I just break down all of the information for Pelias. Um, but going back to fertilizing, what I like to use is um, this fish emulsion fertilizer. You'll notice, if you've seen any of my other videos, I use it for everything. Uh, you don't have to worry about it burning your plants or building up. It's like a nice, gentle fertilizer um, that I've had really good results with. Everything turns out really green, really good. Um, so what I do is, in this uh, half gallon, I have these half gallon watering cans. I'll fill it up halfway, and then I, I measure it. Just, just I just measure it. It makes it easy, a little bit easier. Um, I'll do a half teaspoon fish emulsion fertilizer in a quarter quarter gallon, which is half of the half gallon. Um, and I've already put it in, so you can kind of see how it has a little bit of the murky look to it. The reason I, do, I don't do full strength, I just do half, is whenever I fertilize anything for indoor, you don't want it to get that fish smell. You want it to fertilize it without having a smell, and I've this ratio, quarter gallon with... Uh, uh, with the half teaspoon it seems to work really well and then you can just fertilize um, regularly. Um, with the Pelia though, you, it doesn't need a lot of fertilization, it only needs to be fertilized every month. So you only just fertilize it every month. Don't do any more than that. It, this is a good amount for the plant. Um, yeah, so if, you, if you're if you going to fertilize it, use the fish emulsion, half teaspoon, uh, fill up a quarter gallon, which is half of the half gallon, and then uh, fertilize it once a month during, you could do it during one of your regular watering cycles.